No, because then they're gonna know that the truth always comes out. So I, I don't want anybody to find out all the criminal acts that she's been a part of. How's it going, guys? So here at Avenir Building, gonna meet with Angel. We're gonna talk about some of her homework, which is who are her competitors here in Cebu City. So Angel, one of the things that has been part of your homework this week is looking at different competitors. We talked earlier about how in Bohol, where you are, yes. maybe you only have a couple of competitors, but in a bigger city. But here, I, I was glad I found lots of competitors. Yes, a million, I'm sure. Yes. So what are some of the core competitors that you found here? So one is the colors. Coolers? Yes, coolers. Okay. Yep. And they, are, they have so many branches here, but mm. I found a very near one from here that is there. Yeah. Only. Yes, very close. Yeah. So we're off to coolers. It's one of the competitors that Angel found, and so we're going to try out some of their drinks here, look at their menu, prices, everything else, and see what we could learn. Ready, Angel? Yes, so ready. All right, so yeah. let me know what you think. Okay, I'll try it. It's creamy. It's okay? Yes. It's like a mango float, like what we make every occasion, like that. Mm hmm So how is this different from yours? It's really kind of different because <clears throat> mine is like a shake and this one is like they're using more cream, cream okay. to make it creamy. Okay. So one thing, if you notice here, yes. on the wall, they're selling pizza. They're yeah. also selling yes. French fries. fries. So one thing to think about your business is what complementary food items yes, there are. Like and with the food. With the drinks. Yes. 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 So you want to be thinking about yeah. trying to trying get to each customer to spend more. So if they only are buying drinks from you but they're hungry, yes, then that probably they means... Want, that they will ask like, for food we have, we have. That's right. And if you don't have it, what are they going to do? <laughs> Go to Go someone else. Yes. Absolutely. So not necessarily at the beginning, but yes, at some stage, some I think it's like, worth to look at yes, these different things like, that they have. Explore about this kind of food. Yeah, yes. absolutely. So what do they call this one here? This one? Yeah. It's their mango shake. Mango Burley, shake? Oh, mango shake with pearl. Okay. It's pearly shake that one. But it still have griha, maybe? It's still have griha. Mm. It's not working <laughs> out. Mm. Stop. Oh, ah, stop. Ah, you have pearl failure. <laughs> what do you think? I don't think if they put griha, but just like a mango shake. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but not, I didn't taste like there's a fresh mango. Okay. Maybe they're using a powder or mm. something like that. Yes. No fresh mango? Okay. Yes. So yours is much fresher because it has yeah. real mango? Yeah. All right, guys. So we've looked at competitor number one. On to competitor number two. So I had told you before that I thought your prices were a little bit low. Yes. From Colors, I found out that they have their price for 68 pesos. Okay. Yes. Like and I haven't found for their sizes like mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. but I think this 68 pesos for their price is the small one. Okay, yes. so competitors are charging between maybe 40 to 100 percent yes. more. Yes, like yeah. that. Yeah, so this is really important, I think, for you to think about with oh. pricing. I know yes. that when you're a new business, one of the big temptations is yeah. to really lower your prices yes. and to try to beat everybody out based on prices, but it's very hard to grow a business that way. Yes, sir. Uh, if, if you want to be able to expand and be able to add staff and, you know, different things like that, it's really important that you're making not, you know, enough to be able to, to put away the savings to be able to do those things. Yeah. We're trying... That was a very loud motorcycle. So we're trying to find some uh, local competitors for Angel, for serving different mango drinks. What better place than a place called Mango Six? So one of the important things to have a look at with competitors is not just the drink and how it tastes, yes. but the customer service, yes, how clean things are, yes, how they serve things, you know. Mm, like they're using new technology. Like. Yes. yes. Yeah, like how they made us yes. actually punch in our own order, yes. which, I don't know what you think. I didn't really like that because I felt like they were giving me a job yes. instead of just taking my order themselves. 
but very friendly here. Everything's very clean. For me, I, I actually don't really like stuff like this yeah. because I'd rather someone just take the time to bring me my food. Yes. I know that this is kind of makes things efficient for them. Yes. They're not really too busy in here. Yes. So for me, they're very friendly at the front. But I don't know about you, but I'd rather someone just come and deliver me my food instead of mm. expecting me to go and go get it. And get the food. Absolutely. Th thank you, waitress, Daniela. <laughs> it's the moment of truth. <laughs> Tell us what you think. It looks like, what's your yes. impression of how it looks? Mm. It's, good? Yeah, it's good because it has, like, ice cream, we bought ice cream. Mm. That's why, maybe that is why it's so expensive. What, what is this, though? This is like a vanilla ice cream. Oh, okay. So but vanilla I don't have ice cream? like this in my, in my shake. Okay. So, everybody's dying to know what Angel thinks. It's too big. Like not, uh, not real mango? Yes. Ah. Not there. Now you taste some mango? Like, uh, mango Alright, so how about going back to coolers? Mm. If you were to rate what you thought one out uh, of ten, the... ten being the best, what do you give them? <laughs> I just do the judging. <laughs> <laughs> but it's oh, important yes, for you to really yes. know what you so, think. Yeah. I think it's like eight. Like... An eight over there? Mm. Wow, that's very kind. I would give that personally maybe like a three. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> but how about the mm, the, the other one? one. Mm, the, it's more fine. like five because it's five? not they're not using uh, fresh mango. Okay. But this you think fresh mango mm. mixed in there? Fresh okay, mango, but there's there's lacking uh, yam so that I could compare it with my with your drink. Yeah, sure. But how about as a whole drink? What do you give this? Mm, it's for me, uh, maybe like six. Okay. <laughs> maybe six. <laughs> <laughs> so actually, this is one of the most memorable things for me with this Mango Six in La Hogue. There was a time that I came here and I must have forgot like 500 pesos that uh, with leftover change from my order and they must have told me they were going to give it to me after I'd started eating. And then I walked out apparently without forgetting it. And then like two to three months later, I came back to this particular Mango Six and they said, uh, sir, last time you were here, you know, you forgot this 500 pesos. And after like two or three months, they left the money here waiting for me. So that's the thing about different restaurant businesses. Sometimes it's the food, sometimes it's the servers. And in this place, not only is the food pretty good, everything I've tried here, but I'm just so impressed with the honesty with their employees here. You know, one of the things that we talked about this week is that you sell drinks centered around mango. Mm. And so I'm kind of curious with other mango places if yeah. they only have mango drinks or maybe mm, some no. other flavors. They have some like a lot of flavors. Like they combine mangoes with avocados, mm -hmm. like mangoes with strawberries, like that. What do you think? It's Flavorful. Flavorful? Yes. Okay. So, what's in this one? We definitely saw them put real mango in mm, there. Real mango. They had a lot of good graham cracker. Yes. They put lots of graham crackers. Okay. So, what about the bulk of it? Is it cream? Is it milk? What is that inside? It's. Uh, I can taste the uh, flavor of mango. Okay. Yes. Okay. But what's the, the main white part that I'm looking at down here? Ah, uh, this one. Yeah, what do they use for that? Maybe it's like a uh, whipped cream. They put whipped cream okay. in, the, in the, like, walling of the cup. Okay. So this one seems like maybe they've spent the most on the food ingredients. What mm. do you think? It's good. It's so sweet. Uh, so what about this one, you know, like one to ten? One to ten, okay. Yeah, what's your rating on this? Uh, um, because it's lacking of, um, Sago or the tapioca pearl. Okay. So it's like, but good thing because they have the ice cream yep. on the top and it's mm -hmm. like, okay, I'll give it eight. Eight? Yes. Wow. Okay, so this is your favorite so far? Mm. Okay. Yes. It's quite um, closer to my. To yours? Yes. Ah, okay. So I think we got a winner so far, but we still got one more to go for this one. Uh, mm. We're looking at, this was a mango, mango strawberry? Mango strawberry flavor with Graham also. Yeah, Graham cracker too. Yes. So, ice cream. Ice cream. Yeah, real mango in this one as well. Yes. 
Uh, so this is a different drink than you have. Mm, because we want to explore, like we combine two fruits in a cup. Yeah, Angel wants to see what other competitors are doing in yes. terms of not just strictly mango, but some other flavors as well. Yes. So exactly. let's see what you think of this one. Um, I think it's they're using um, fresh mango for the shake, and also um, I think this is just like a strawberry syrup. I don't understand that. <laughs> you don't understand the taste. <laughs> I didn't know How come? Know. Just it doesn't mix well together? Yes. Okay. Mango and strawberries are not friends. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I would have thought mangoes and strawberries would have been friends, but not in this drink. Yes. But I think because it's not real strawberry, right? Yes, yeah, because it's not strawberry. It's yeah. Strawberry. It's like just a syrup. Okay. Using, like, so what about this one? One to ten. How do you rate it? I'll rate it like five. A five? Okay. Yeah, because I don't understand the taste. Okay. So I would say we definitely got a winner I didn't. today. Lots of different uh, drinks that we've uh, tried, but I think for you has it been a good experience trying different competitors, mm, yes. looking at their pricing, presentations. Yes. And the taste, of course. Absolutely. Good stuff. All right. Well, I think that is enough mango drink trying yes, for us uh, for a day. Leave a comment below, and if you haven't already, comment subscribe. Below. Absolutely. Yes. As always, thank you for taking the time to watch, and... And take care. Bye. Bye. No, because then they're going to know that she changes her name in camera. So I, I don't want anybody to find out all the criminal acts that she's been a part of. No, I am guilty. <laughs> the truth always comes out. Sorry to Daniela's mom if she's watching. Okay, orange. <laughs> so welcome guys to ordering in the Philippines. Uh, there's a secret cameraman behind me. Anyhow, no McDonald's for me. I got some cucumbers and some food that I've taken with me. I'm trying to lose some weight here, so I'm being a good boy still. Not quite as good as McDonald's fries though. Kind of creepy secret cameraman. <laughs> <laughs>